Do you want to know how to clone yourself in a picture? Then keep on watching this video because in this video I'm gonna teach you how to do it. By the way, if you're new here, welcome to my channel. My name is Kareem. If you like to see more videos like this, then please make sure to subscribe to my channel down below and let's start the video. Okay, so what you will need to clone yourself is Photoshop, a tripod and a camera. So what you're going to do is you're going to put the camera on the tripod and take a picture first of the location where you're shooting. So let's say you're doing it here in your room or in the living room or somewhere. Just place the tripod there and take a picture. That's the first one. Um, then you're going to take another picture with yourself maybe on the left side. And then you take another picture with yourself on the right side. You can do this by using the self timer or use an app on your phone to take the picture. Once you got all the pictures, then we go to Photoshop. So let's start. Okay, so right now, as you can see on my screen, I have opened two pictures. And what we're going to do is uh, copy and paste one of the pictures into the same document as the other. So as you can see here on the right side, I have two layers on top of each other. Now the top layer, you're going to select that one and put the coverage down. So as you can see, now you look a little bit invisible, <laughs> a little bit see-through. And what I'm doing right now is uh, using the eraser tool. And with the eraser tool, I'm just going over my picture over myself in the in the picture so and what it does it makes you actually visible in the other layer so you're using the eraser tool to erase yourself out of the top layer so you will be visible in the bottom layer or actually the other way around I, th I think <laughs> it's a bit late at the time I'm recording this, <laughs> so excuse me if uh, if I'm sounding a little bit sleepy, but um, yeah. So what I'm doing right now is I'm just going to uh, keep on doing this, keep on going with the eraser tool until um, everything looks good in the picture, and uh, yeah. Let me fast forward a little bit. Okay, so in this point of the video, I'm searching for another picture to add to the photo. So actually, instead of two, I'm using a third picture, but you can use how many you like. Like if you like uh, five pictures, you can clone yourself five times, three times, whatever you want. Um, so right now I'm doing the same process all over again. I'm uh, looking for the right layer to use the eraser tool once again and to um, erase myself so I get visible in the other picture. Um, what I forgot to do here but what I'm realizing later is to um, do like a, what's it called? To merge uh, the layers so you need to merge the two layers together so you can clone yourself three times 
Okay, so as you can see, I'm selecting the two layers. Click the right side of the mouse, the right button, and then I'll choose uh, Merge Layers. So now in layer one, there are the two pictures together from before. And now in layer two is the third picture I added. And as you can see now I'm <laughs> selecting the wrong layer. So that doesn't work. So the layers need to be the other way around. And then put the coverage down again. So I was a bit confused here. But the wrong layer. And now finally I get the right layer. So now it's the same thing all over again just using the eraser tool and uh, really try to take your time to be as precise as possible because that makes the result look more realistic even though it's not realistic at all <laughs> but you know what I mean so uh, yeah let me fast forward it one more time till the end result so you can see how it looks in the end So right now I'm cropping the image, oh, it's still on fast forward, but I've cropped the image to 4x5 ratio, so I can upload it to Instagram, and now I'm just messing around with the colors and contrast, but uh, you don't have to do this, basically you can just save the file now and uh, export it and uh, enjoy your clones so this was the tutorial i hope you guys liked it if you did then please make sure to click the like button and also subscribe to my channel you can subscribe right here and make sure to also hit the notification bell so you get a notification every time i upload a new video and i'll see you guys next time